Welcome to the Recreating You game. This is a live course that we delivered between 2018 and 2020. We've now gone on to do a new program that we love called the Smart Soul Experience. But I wanted to put this out there onto YouTube because we had thousands of people that had extraordinary results and I think it's just an amazing program. So I wanted to give it to you guys for free. So here's the deal. Please bring a friend. This is way more fun to do with someone else. Do the days in order. It's supposed to be done day one through day 12. There's a reason for that. It builds on itself. Have a great time and you're going to have amazing ahas about your inner experience. This will cure, yes, cure stress, anxiety, worry, fear, and overwhelm in your life, as well as giving you direction on the next right thing for you to do in every moment. Have a great time. Enjoy the program. All right. Hello, hello, welcome to day five of the Recreating You game. All right, I'm super excited. Okay, this is one of my personal favorite days. This is super incredible. If you have ever studied the law of attraction, then today is the day for you. <laughs> so what is important is, is that the part of the IGS, its goal or its mission, so to speak, is to get you only doing things in your life that open you that that are that are yours to do that's what's so important is the things that are yours to do so yesterday's play of the day the should have to need to and must clears out stuff i do that practice on a regular basis i don't have to write it down on a piece of paper anymore because it's just part of my life i'm checking in with the igs as i go along you won't have to write everything down forever you'll be checking in with your igs as you go along it just clears stuff out of the way it's super powerful i just want to say <sighs> How freeing is that? That there are things that are not yours to do in this world, right? That you can get rid of. I mean, that's so amazing if you think about it. So today, today, day five, play of the day is what I call, and I've alluded to it before, divine purchase order approved. I believe that it is our desires that open us. Our truest desires is what we're intended to follow and be led by. That's why dreaming big is so important. That's why you, you know, making, not leaving your desires behind is crucial, right? From the time that you were born, your divine purpose and path is all about what desires open you. And when you get an opening to something, it is yours or something better that is coming to you. Yours or something better. That's why I say divine purchase order approved. And the goal is, as you, as you de desire things, get the opening, and then you go back to following what I call flow. We're gonna talk about flow next, okay, tomorrow. Don't worry about flow right now. And flow leads you throughout your day, opening to opening to opening throughout your day, and you don't have to worry about how you're gonna get your divine purchase order approved. You already know it's coming because you got the opening that it is. Let it go, be excited and thrilled that it's coming to you, and then just go on with living your life, being a part of your purpose every day, and then you're guided to what you're supposed to be a part of while in the background, these amazing things that you know because you opened are on their way to you or something better. You understand? So as long as you're open, there's no resistance in your body to get in the way of things coming to you. And as you clear out the yellow yield signs from your old belief systems and patterns and you stay open more and more, you're in a complete state of allowing. You're not, there's no resistance to the good stuff coming to you. You're more resilient, you're more flexible. And not only that, you're contributing to your, what your gifts are, what you're here to contribute. And you're, what you're here to contribute, there's 100,000 life purposes you have. Don't get overwhelmed, don't get overwhelmed. They're the giving your friend that amazing book they needed, making that phone call where they're like, oh, I so needed to talk to you today. Could be taking care of yourself and taking a nap is your life's purpose for that day. Taking care of a grandbaby so that your child can work and, and survive. You know, raising beautiful children and being a part of their lives on a daily basis. You're guided through your openings on how to participate in your own life so that you're showing up beautifully. So today's exercise, today's play of the day, day five, is for you to make a list of everything you desire, big and small. And, and in that list, make a desire for other people, what you desire maybe for your, have to happen for your children or friends of yours that may be in need or our planet at large. And if you get an opening, turn it, move that to, as you go through your list, you'll get an open, closed, or neutral. If you get an opening, move that to a master list because those things are coming or something better. 
if you get a closing sensation, those things that close you that you desire are not right for you. They won't make you happy or there's something off in what you desire. Maybe you desire to be in a relationship with a particular person and your mind's all wrapped up in being with that person, but you close about being with that person. There's a reason that person isn't the one for you. There's someone better. Or maybe it's timing. You have a desire for a mate, but you close at having that desire right now. Well, there's other things coming to you and having that mate, maybe there's some building up you need to do inside yourself, or there's stuff that you're supposed to go through in the meantime, and your soulmate coming to you closes you because it's not right timing. Divine timing's important, all right? And then when you get a neutral, think, hmm, that just means that there's not enough information or you're not dreaming big enough. So what would be even better than that desire you had? And when you have openings, you move them to the master list. You can read them and go back every once in a while, but you don't have to worry about those. They're coming to you. So do this because if you don't express your desires, which is like asking for them, then they can't come for you. So you need to be really clearly aware. Now, the thing I also want to mention is this is not the same thing as addictive desires, you know, that we use to, to make ourselves feel comfortable in the moment or to cover up uncomfortable feelings. So it's not about addictive desires to like drugs or alcohol or sugar or work up being a workaholic or, you know, I'm talking about desires that create a relaxed state of openness in the body or an expanded, excited feeling. Oftentimes, when we have an addictive desire, we're closed and we're trying to make ourselves feel better. We're trying to make ourselves, our bodies and our spiritual experience on the planet better by doing these other things. And I'm not judging those other things. You might even open it doing those other things if that's what your beingness needs in the moment to move forward and survive what you're going through. It's okay. I've been there. And those things fall away over time. They just fall away because you don't need them anymore in following your IGS. You become healthier and healthier and your daily life, you're open to open to open. And so you have less and less need to cover up with something that's addictive and, and, and changing your state. All right? So today's practice, 555, five, five, today of the day today, is to write your opening desires, a list of your opening desires, and purchase order approved, move them to a master list. Enjoy, enjoy. I, I'm sending you love and blessings, and I hope you have an amazing, amazing day. Thank you so much for doing the Recreating You game. I hope you're having extraordinary ahas already. People have from day one. And so no matter where you are in the game, there's amazing things that you're learning about yourself and the power that lies within you. If you would like to have your questions answered, please put them in the comments below. We do our best to get back to comments or so does our, our members <laughs> and our students. They love to go ahead and, and support people in learning to use their IGS. You are welcome to email us at support at smartsoul.com to get more deep into the programs, or you can go to smartsoulacademy.com if you already know you want to jump in and learn how to master this extraordinary thing that you were born with, your internal guidance system. There you'll find 16 programs that lead you through all areas of your life and weekly group coaching with me so that we can work on your specific issues and supporting you and getting aligned with your purpose, your prosperity, and peace. That's smartsoulacademy.com, and it's all available to you for $25 a month. I know, amazing. You can afford this less than Starbucks each week. Come check it out. SmartSoulAcademy.com.